Hello and welcome back, guys. Okay, so... Oops. Uh, there we go. Okay, I got carried away there, sorry. So, what we want to do here is to be able... Uh, let me change the pagination here real quick so I can see all my files here at once. So, I will go to my app and HTTP controllers and that's the home controller and let's change the limit to 10 so come back here and refresh okay so we have our files but what I want is to be able to select files based on the category that we have so let's let's separate these guys into different categories shall we so if I now go to my admin, I'll right click and open the admin section here. Let's go to categories, there's food and drinks, and let me go to my posts. All of these are on food. Let's edit one of these and edit. it. Let's change from food to drinks, but it seems we don't have that option, do we now? No, we do not. So let's see why this is. So if we go to the home controller here, you see that we are able to read. There's a part where we read all the categories, which is right here. So that's this is what we need. So I'm going to copy all of this. Copy. And then I will open my... Um, what do I open here in the admin controller? Let's go to uh, post edit. Yes. Mm -hmm. So this one right here, eared it. And I want to get all the categories. Mm -hmm. So let me paste right here. Uh, Wait a minute, this one only works when we post, so that's not what I'm looking for. Category is equal to, and I get one category here. I have no idea why. Okay, so I'm just getting the category that I belong to. But let's also get all the categories, shall we? So I would do this. Let's make sure we have the DB facade active here. Okay. Okay. So it is there. That's good. Where are we? Right here. So we have one category, but let's duplicate this and put categories. Same thing here. Good. So now we have access to all the categories. Now, let's go to the view itself, edit post. So this is resources, views, and admin, edit post. Now, we have this category that gives us one category here, which is okay because we need this. Uh, this is the, the category we have originally that is saved with this edit that we are making. But let's duplicate this and do a loop, shall we? So we'll do a loop. We'll do a for each. And the for each will be for categories. As, so I'll just shortcut this and say cat like so. And then let's do end for each. Good. Now we can use cat instead and so I just need to delete all that like so. Good. That should work. So let's refresh and click here. Now I have uh, options, right? I'll click on drinks. Now before I do this, uh, I need the ID as well. So instead of raw here, it should be cat like that. Okay. Refresh again. 
Let's change this to drinks. Oops, we have a problem. So it's saying an undefined property cat ID. So let's remove the category itself. It's just ID. That's what it is in the table. So refresh. There we go. So drinks it is. And let's uh, save. Okay, so we have saved. Let's go back to posts and see. So we see we have drinks, we have food. That's very cool. Now, since we have this, we can use that in our uh, system here to search for a particular category. So I want, to, when I click drinks, I see only posts for drinks, food, etc., etc. So let's make the proper links here. Now, the system here will work exactly like how the search works. Let's say test like so. So I get this. You see what the URL has, it's find is equal to test. Now instead of find, we're just going to use category and we'll abbreviate it with cat. So let's go to our um, uh, header dot bladed dot PHP. Mm -hmm. So there's a part where we are echoing out our categories. This is the one right here. Now we just need to add an href or a link to where we want to go. So I'll copy this, put it here. So URL is equal to, this is on the home page, right? So home page and yeah, it is on the home page. So if it was another page, for example, maybe single post, we'll put single post here, like so, but we are searching on the home page. So we just leave it as it is. And then we'll put a question mark, like so. We can actually put it right here. Hmm. Wait a second. Let me just put it right here. Question mark, and we'll call it cat is equal to. And then here, I want to add uh, one of these category ID. So copy. I'll just add it after the uh, the, uh, the closing quote. I'll say dot category ID. Let's see how that works. Refresh. Click here. Hover. Okay, so it's working fine. You can see the link down here as you hover. This cat is equal to two, cat is equal to one. Very good, very good. Now that we have that, we can close this. We don't need it anymore. Let's go back to the admin controller. And at the very top, where is the top here? I want to find where we are searching. Oh, this is the admin controller. It's the home controller. So this is where we search which is the find. So all we need to do is add another if statement and let's actually copy everything. Copy, paste, like so, and put else there. So we have this else if, if cat is set. Uh -huh. Cat. Uh -huh. So let's add uh, search by category. Here we'll say search by title. Yes, so search by category. So here we'll say select all from, that's the query. This is all good. What's important is the, this part, the where clause. So where category ID, instead of like, we're going to say is equal to, now instead of title, we'll say, hmm, wait a minute here. We just call it ID, yeah, that's fine. Limit, limit, offset, offset, good. And then here we'll say ID. 
is equal to let's remove the wild cards here like this Ta -ta 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 -ta. let's just make sure it's an integer but anyway it doesn't really matter at all uh, id so let me change that to id both of those goody and that's about it so let's refresh the page click here to go to the home page so i want to search by drinks yes so i'll click here and click drinks and you see only one appears very cool let me search by food you see two of these in that category appear so the category is working very well now if you want to be able to search by category even here you can do the same thing make the link the same as we we did here on this part and it work okay so pretty cool uh, actually i should change the link here on the post the text isn't leading to the right place but the image is so this one leads to not found so let's fix that real quick so let's go to the single where is this single to play no actually it's the uh, home index the blade of php so where is the link here the link is on the image the href here so i'll copy this so instead of putting the href here i'll put it on the entire article and let me remove these here for the category we don't need them uh-huh where is the other one this other one is right here on the title now instead i'll move this whole thing i don't want to disturb the flow of the document so I'll just move it right inside the article here and then the closing a tag right before the closing article right there so everything in here will be clickable so I'll refresh okay so now if i click anywhere here there we go cool all righty then very good so now we're able to search by category easily and straightforward all right i'll see you in the next video